Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, Destiny here. And today I'm gonna to do a really quick uh, demo and review on the Hourglass Ambient Light Set. And I also have a little bit of a miniature birthday haul for you guys. So I'm gonna go ahead and jump right into the birthday haul first because I'm probably gonna talk a lot longer about the Ambient Palette. Okay guys, so my birthday was the other day and if you follow me on Twitter, you know that I'm not really a birthday person. But I did wanna share some of the gifts that I got from my friends out in the beauty world. And um, first of all, I got a little nail polish set and I think this is really, really extremely cute. Number one, the colors are really, really pretty and I love the concept behind it. It's kind of like a mommy and me um, pedicure kit. The colors I got are so in love and that's the mommy color and it's a really, really pretty lilac-y, pinky color, super, super pretty. And then the other color is My Pool Party, which is really pretty and it's a really, really popular color right now. And personally, if I had a daughter, we'd probably switch colors. I think the blue is a little bit more intriguing. Um, next up, I got a really, really pretty dress, larger print paisley dress and it has really pretty rust tones in there, turquoise. It's African styled. I absolutely love the cut of this dress. I think it's super gorgeous. It's from Simply Sicily. Um, I got this, sh this shirt from I'd rather be with my dogs.com because actually on Instagram, and if you follow me here on YouTube, you know that I used to have a pit bull. He now lives with my dad. Um, but I absolutely love my dog. I love pits and this, shirt is just perfect and of course most times I would rather be with my dog I thought this was really cute and I had to share it um, from hollow and Ridge I got some face and body toner and this is rose water and it smells really really great it's really great after you wash your face especially if you're like me I've been using a lot of not harsh but a lot of stronger face washes lately because my face has been breaking out so I've been using stronger and drying stuff this one in particular it's not very drying and it smells really really nice so that doesn't hurt so I got this little box right here this is from tritheworld.com and I think this is awesome as soon as I open it and kind of show you what's inside you'll see why I wanted to do an open box for this I didn't know how awesome it was otherwise I would have so basically this is a bi-monthly box I believe and you can sign up for this and take a virtual trip anywhere in the world my trip is from Japan. When you open it, you get all different types of trinkets and really cool snacks. I got an origami paper culture guide uh, from Japan. And when you open it, it shows you all different types of facts about Japan. Like there's a sesame cookie, I believe this is. I'm not positive, but it looks really good. Chopsticks, which are really, really nice. But I mean, they're really cool and they're just really, really authentic looking. and. It's not like you just went to Chinatown and picked up some stuff. Like there's a really nice assortment of different things in here. Oi Tea Company, I'm probably pronouncing that wrong. And that's a matcha blueberry um, tea mix in there, which sounds really, really nice. Conpito Sugar Candy, which is really, really cute and has really cute characters on the top. Uh, ginger Seasoning. And they have all different areas of the world that you can visit and all different types of snacks and cookies and cakes and I'm all about this box. I'm really excited. I can't wait for my next box to come. I just wanted to share that with you because I'm not such a huge birthday person. I didn't want to completely be a miser. I wanted to show you what I got. I also got these really cool jet set dresses from my friends over at jetsetdress.com. I actually really like this in particular because I'm a big fan of pencil skirts. I'm a big fan of tube top dresses as well, not so much tube tops themselves. And that's exactly what this dress is. It's like a long tube that you can do a million things with. It's very, very body conscious. So it's like a body con tube, which I'm really super into. And you can do a million things with these, you know. I got a pink and I got a gray. I cannot wait to try these. Number one, I feel like I'm gonna be addicted. And number two, I feel like they're gonna be really, really easy to wear because you can wear them in so many different ways. So thank you so much for all those gifts. I will have information about those companies in the bottom bar if you wanna check that out. I wanna go ahead and jump into this ambient light palette right now. Okay, so first of all, wow, you get three colors. You get three colors, you get dim light, incandescent light, and radiant light. And I absolutely love um, dim light. Dim light is really pretty, especially right now I have a nude lipstick. And it's not exactly the warmest of nudes, so you may not want a stark gold highlight because it may kind of throw your makeup off a little bit if you are an OCD makeup person like me. 
Um, sometimes I really get into tonal matching and different things like that. But I absolutely love these because these are non-chunky, they are smooth, they are incredibly milled, just finely, finely milled. Um, they are buttery, they are, for people who want that highlight, that in your face highlight, but they don't want it in your face, but they want it all in your face, if that makes any sense. The colors are so muted, there goes my light. The colors are so muted and soft and they're just non-abrupt. They're just, like if you look at my face, like you, can, you can't really see color, but you can see so much depth, dimension, highlight, so much pop. My cheekbones, my face looks fresh and healthy, but not too moist or too sticky or wet. It's almost a do, but it's just, I love these. I actually also have diffused light, which I love and also have on my face. I use this as my under eye setting powder with a little bit of camel from Ben Nye on top. I mix it together and you get a very soft, very diffused light, very blurry. I'm getting really excited because I've had these for a while and they weren't really that popular and I've used them in videos before and I have a lot of products like these, oddly enough, but nothing exactly like these. I have products that are comparable and if you don't wanna splurge, you can try this and this and kind of get the same effect, but these are brilliant and ingenious and if I actually deepened my foundation, especially to show you guys the demo, because these are absolutely brilliant on dark skin. They are not too warm or too cool, depending on what colors you get. They're not too chunky because when you're darker skinned and you have texture in your skin and you put a chunky highlighter on that, let me tell you something about just rough texture. Look, when it comes to texture and tone in skin, it really will show if you have a really dark backdrop, especially against something that's gonna sparkle, sheen, shine, or draw attention. Um, I'm sure you guys have seen it, probably even in my videos, I'm sure every now and again when you have that shimmery powder over open pores or over enlarged pores, it just does not look really good. And these are like almost just indetectable, you can't even, I could gush for hours, but I'm just gonna go ahead and tell you that these are a go. Everyone's been asking me, are these great for dark skin? I haven't seen many reviews. Are these worth picking up? They are worth picking up. They're not worth picking up if you cannot afford it. If you don't have extra income, I will show you other products that are very similar that can give you the same effect without making you look at it every day and thinking like, wow, did I really need this? Because this was $65 for these three colors. You can break that down to $20 and change each, which is not the worst. You get a decent amount of product. And believe me, once you get these and you get into these, you are gonna be into these and using these constantly. Okay, so there's this taupey one that has I absolutely love for nude lipsticks and a neutral makeup highlight because sometimes you don't want a bright gold highlight. Like people are like, oh my God, like I don't understand these. Like what is not to understand? This looks like an angel breathed onto your face. It's just such butter and glow. I love these. And then there's like a middle one that's like a softier pink. I like that for pinky, peachy nude lipsticks and blushes and you want a soft, beautiful highlight. And then this one over here, this dim light is great for purple lip colors, for taupey, of course, colors. And you just want that highlight that is not a super duper color. It's more like you're under a certain lighting and that lighting is just blessing your face like. <laughs> I can't talk anymore, I'm done. Okay guys, so I will have the information in the bottom bar. I'm gonna show you a quick demo here in this video and stay tuned for the full entire tutorial on this face look. Um, I absolutely love you guys to pieces. I am at over 200,000 subscribers and that is insane. I have so many, of course, always changes come to my channel and I want you guys to stay tuned for that. As always, I'm gonna thank you so much for commenting, rating, and subscribing. I'll be in touch and hopefully you'll do the same. Bye guys. So here's a really soft, it feels like a macaroon, except we have these delicious, I'm saying they're delicious already. <laughs> and there's like a little bean or maybe it's bean, is it black bean? I don't know, it's very crispy. I don't really do seaweed. Um, mm, these are very good. I would love a coffee that tastes like this, I would love.